Okay, I just want to talk about cheating for a moment. Okay, so cheating is unfortunately something that goes on, happens in marriages, and whether or not it's in a boy or girlfriend relationship, and it's awful, it's horrible, and it's wrong. Um, the pain that you would have gone through and then could you ever trust that person again? Um, also, for my knowledge, that hasn't happened for me. I could have been, I just don't know if did they lie about it to you because trust is important and vital to have in a relationship. I remember going up to a boyfriend of mine at the time and I said to him it, I don't care I don't care if you lie to your mum uh, friends at work whatever but don't lie to me. Um, and we actually did talk briefly about it. I think cheating is by far the worst. When you are in a marriage, especially if you have kids because you kind of think of them but at the same time this has happened to you and uh, the best piece of advice that I've heard is to lean on loose women wait until the anger dies down um, that is fantastic advice because to Many people make a decision when they are angry and they go, like, say they want a divorce and they go through all sorts of legal proceedings and then across the table from each other, one person says, I can't do this, I can't go through with it. Um, I think some people may want to make them allergies work, but it's, it is fair pride and self-respect um, that comes in into their heads and especially because although we think about cheating as it applies to women it happens to men and um, and I think for a man especially for a man it is by far one of the most humiliating things for a man to have to admit to people at work or his closest mates that his girlfriend or his wife has cheated. And actually, if it happens in that particular way, there is a high 
he hasn't come back and he won't. Um, for me, choosing is a no-go. If someone is dating or, or in a relationship with me, I'm not going to want to share you. Um, and if you cheat on me, more for you. Because I won't take you back. Um, if you are my husband and I see you as mine, I'd be angry. I'd be very very angry because one of my personal issues is I have been known to live in the past and people tell me that when I talk to them about the things that have happened in my childhood or in my teenage years because I find it hard to let go it takes a long time, if not more, f for me to be able to let go of past hurts and past grievances. Um, if you are my husband, once, once. It would take me a long time to get over and let it go. But I'm not one of those women who would take him back, taking him back, because at the same time, or oh. Um, this has happened, if you repeatedly take people back, you are giving them permission to hurt you more, because they know they can get away with it. Oh, why bother? She'll take me back. Once, only ever once. If a person is going to cheat, then they are literally going to cheat. And and um, people always talk about ask the words. Oh, perhaps I wasn't good looking enough. Perhaps I wasn't. Good in bed, or this, that, and the other. No, no, no. Do not question yourself. Do not put yourself down like that. And this man has obviously gone out and come across you. Um, and I think, Erin in mind, when Colleen gives that fantastic advice, it depends on the state of your marriage. If you really love each other, and all it was was, um, all it was was that you listening to each other or whatever that's different of some people actually need it over because if you are in a marriage of convenience or if you are in a loveless marriage or it was forced people up for good. So heating in my head, in my book, 
is not something I'd ever condone. Yes, people have um, desires, like if an attractive woman was to walk past and there's boobs hanging out, I'd look and say, look, Harry, did you see her knockers? You know, it, because I am more for pointing out that type of, type of stuff. Uh, but I just think at the end of the day, if someone has um, done the nasty across you, like kissing all the way down to being intimate and having sex, more than once I'm really sorry but for me personally I would not hate them at 